Hello everybody. This week's camera is the Kodak Advantix C800. Came out in about uh, 2000, same year that the uh, Nikon Coolpix 880 that I reviewed and also Kodak's DC 4800 uh, digital cameras came out. So Kodak kind of helped to contribute to the demise of APS film by competing with themselves. So it was about a $200 camera when it first came out. And at the same time, digital consumer cameras had finally broken uh, below $1,000. So enough of the historical side note. This has a uh, 27 to 80 millimeter zoom lens, uh, six element, it uh, doesn't have much of an aperture. It's uh, f5.6 to 11.6 widest and uh, 8.6 to f16 tele. It'll autofocus from 2 feet to infinity. It'll do date, time, and text imprint. You couldn't select the text. It had happy birthday, happy anniversary, Valentine's Day, vacation, things like that. You selected it using these tiny little buttons back here. So they included hopefully that will focus this tiny little uh, what do they call it control button activator little stylus on the wrist strap uh, it has a format mask in the viewfinder I was pushing the button to change uh, from HDTV port, uh, panorama and classic I was looking for lights it actually masks it down in the viewfinder uh, surprisingly it has a diopter on the viewfinder so that's kinda nice it took uh, ISO 50 to 1600 film. These days you pretty much only find 200 and 400. Uh, you can find some decent film. Even refrigerated film is starting to show its age. So if you have an APS camera, shoot with it while you can. A uh, really nice thing about this camera, it has mid-roll change. The T550 that I shot with before this has mid-roll rewind so what I did was I did a mid-roll rewind on the other camera took a screwdriver and moved the APS cartridge from the X for fully exposed to the half moon which is partially exposed popped it in this one it chugged along the film advance and got to the point where it said fresh film so I was able to finish out the roll in this that was pretty cool um, that's about it. So really I've already shot with this, but uh, I'll uh, post some pictures and I'll see you then.